Hi, it's Joella Milan, Licensed Esthetician, and I want to wish you all happy holidays. I have not done any videos during this holiday season because I've been working 15 hours a day. It's just been crazy. That's all I could tell you. So, and I'm sure all of us have felt the same way. It's just been a lot of uh, pressure, you know, and stress that we've all had to go through. And what, what I wanted to share with you today is uh, keeping with my, what I say all the time is that if you keep your skin nice, you don't need to worry about makeup, uh, wearing a lot of makeup. I know there's so many wonderful tutorials with people showing you all these great makeup tips, but you know, for every day, we just either don't have the time and unless you, you're seeing someone, you don't need to worry about it. So I, you know, I keep my skin nice. I keep, keep everything simple and, and I'm happy with my skin. So what I wanted to share with you today to keep it again very easy is I, I could not be without the Joella Milan Capture Youth Water. I've been using this what, four or five years now. And if you use this right, you've got to rub it in. You don't just spray it or, or, or uh, pump it on. You've got to really rub it into the skin. Rub it, rub it, rub it. I do that every morning, every night. And another great tip is rub it in, put on your skincare products and then go back and put this on again because it helps it penetrate. Penetrating, firming, toning, lifting. It's magical. And it takes, one of my clients has said it took 10 years off her face. And you know, I want to say the same thing. So uh, on my nights when I'm so tired, I just take off my makeup and rub this in. And a lot of times I just go to bed and that's it. I don't want to do anything else. So, um, Joella Milan Capture Youth Water. I have great prices for my customers and I'll have the link below for you. And another thing I wanted to share, which I came upon by accident, is, um, you know, the osmosis, the, the uh, skin perfecting primer. Well, I always talked about the luminous one because I like my skin to be luminous. Well, I use this one because this one is the, the matte, the matte primer. And, and it comes out white. Well, anyway, like a white cream. Sorry, is it not coming out? Oh, here you go. Comes out like a white cream. But when you put this on your face, it just, uh, you know, it goes on creamy and it gives it like a matte look. And I find even if I just have that on, I put that on and a little tinted sunscreen and my skin looks good. You don't even need makeup or anything. It just gives it that nice... Uh, almost an airbrush kind of look, you know? So it's the it's the matte primer. I've never talked about this before, but this is one of my new best friends. So I use this. And then another suggestion, you know, sometimes when you go in the drugstore or the, uh, you know, makeup thing and you see something, you think, mm, should I try that or not? I did that the other day. I bought this product, which I would, you know, I'm not going to link it because I don't have anything to do with it. But it was, it was, uh, it's, a, it's a crystal glow tinted illuminator. And I think it was $15. And, you know, I kind of had to play around with it a little bit. But I just put this on, put this on. It even has like a little brush on the other end. Put that on. And then uh, if you want to put a little makeup on top of it, you want to put a little bit of blush. It looks so good. You know, like I said, I had to play around with this a little bit. Sometimes when you find these things in the drugstore, you know, just don't just do it one time and go, oh, I don't like the way it looks. Kind of play around with it and see how it works. But these are both not really a lot of makeup. They're just so simple. So the Capture Youth Water and these, and then a little blush. And that's what I've got on today. I didn't even put any mascara on. Oh no, I did. I did. I lied. I lied. I did. I did put a little mascara on. So, but look how easy that is. And it's, I feel anti-aging, you know, now I could go to the store or wherever I want to go and feel like I look good and I don't have a lot of makeup on. And if I need to put on a mask, I could put that on too and it's not going to come off on it. But it's so simple, you know, because that right now, uh, you know, overdoing it with makeup is not really where you want to be, you know, as far as simplicity on your day-to-day -day living. 
So those are my tips for you. And hopefully I've got a lot of great ideas that I want to bring in my videos. I, I have so many other endeavors that I do that I need to start bringing to you. You know, I haven't, I have incredible jewelry that I've got to start selling. I mean, I've got more jewelry than Bloomingdale's. I'm not kidding. And from that, all my years of buying it and making it and whatever. So, um, and, and just a lot of great things. So I'm excited about it. So uh, I look forward to hearing from you and have a wonderful new year. And I just pray to God for everybody. This next year is wonderful for everyone. Lots of health and happiness and prosperity and just wonderful. Thank you. Bye.